Day is a publication by Tobago author Shanice Sylvan, known by fellow writers as Literally Shin. She told us writing has been a childhood love. I always used to get myself in trouble because, you know, instead of studying for CXE, I used to be reading books. And um, I used to love the, the way how a plot thickens. It goes from something so small and it gets significantly bigger. And I decided that I wanted to write myself because I had a very wild imagination. Shinies began writing this book in 2018, took a pause, then we started during the COVID-19 period. And in 2021, Mommy Day was officially published. It's basically a story about a young girl that was kidnapped when she was small. And then she had the opportunity to get into the new world because she never experienced the new world before. And the book is basically about overcoming obstacles and, you know, getting over past issues and, you know, opening your mind to what is ahead. This young writer, who also received the Nally's First Time Author Award, continues to expand her line of publications. Now, you will notice that the book titles are as if, as if it's letters, right? So the books basically are letters that are written to the person, the main character in the book. And the letters are not ordinary letters, like a long letter. It's just a statement that, you know, brings out the poetic part of the chapter. And so I have Mommy Dear, I have Dear Spells, and I also have coming up to Gabriel with Love. Shini said she gains inspiration from life. I might see a situation happen and I think to myself, hmm, what if it went this way? Or what if, you know, this happened, this person said this and, you know, I create a scenario and I try to get this scenario into a bigger light and build a book around that scenario. And as part of the Writers Guild, Shini said the organization has created several opportunities. One thing that I did with them was the Read Aloud program in Roxburgh Tech School, where I would have gone and read my book. I would have interacted with these children, get their feedback on their creative side as well. And then we had the Caribbean Authors Day, where we celebrated Caribbean authors for their work and what they would have put in. One of her goals is to collaborate with schools in Tobago to develop book clubs and encourage storytelling. I am Carissa Douglas for TTT News, and I love Tobago.